But I wrote an article in the Deseret News yesterday about um, uh, with a little more offense, BYU could could be in a position to win that game. That didn't excuse the defense, but the future of the Big Twelve are these shootouts that they have every week already, and that's what BYU is joining. The difference between winning and losing is pre- pretty small margin, and the difference between college football now and when I played, or even ten years ago, is that with very few exceptions, the teams that can go out and just light it up win. Uh, you know, think Oklahoma, think Alabama, think it, it's it's surprising when you look. Alabama's just dominating teams, but you forget how many people are like even bad teams are scoring. Yeah, on Alabama, I feel like there's a lot of rules changes that that. Uh, our advantage offense. I think offenses have evolved, and I do think things go in cycles. Where I think in a few years, maybe defenses change the way they do things and they catch up. Right now, offenses have the upper hand. We used to say twenty four was a good spot. Like if you could, if you could score more than twenty four, you're going to win a game. Well, not now. No, you better score in the thirties, or you got no chance in the college football. Three today. teams that lost in the Big Twelve last week scored forty or more. And right. lost. And lost. And lost. What did Alabama score and lose? 48. Yeah, it's 48. Alabama. 48. With all those five stars. Alabama scored 48 and lost. So we're going to talk about fixing the BYU defense. That's what the buzz of Cougar Nation is. We're going to talk about that. Yep. And offense. And where we go from here in the Big 12. Yep.